quick disclaimer, this is not financial advice. <laughs> do, 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 do. Once we get rolling, we're rolling. What's up, sons? It's Blind Run with Son of a Tech once again, and today we have yet another how-to video. This one should be pretty straightforward because if you watched my guide on how to get daily payouts from Ethermine, then you've probably already got an idea on how to do this. But for those who don't, we're gonna go over how to swap your Ethereum that you've mined to the Matic network to of course, Matic itself. Now, why would we wanna do this as opposed to moving it to the Ethereum mainnet and cashing out? Well, if you are doing daily payouts, moving to the mainnet's gonna cost a lot in fees. So another option is if you are wanting to hold Matic in Polygon because you think that it's gonna go somewhere, well, this is the cheapest way to do it if you're a miner. So basically at this point, what you're gonna be able to do is essentially mine Matic. And you're gonna do this by following the tutorial first in uh, on the channel and then come back here and we'll show you guys how to swap it. But before we get into it, here's a word from our sponsor. Today's sponsor is myself. To support the channel, click the join button below the video and you will get access to our privately hosted rocket chat. Selecting the 199 option will get you access and after that you need to head over to the membership tab, scroll down and expand out your membership perks. Find the section for connecting on social media and in that section there will be a secret registration URL to join Rocket Chat where you can sign up to enjoy talking with other cryptocurrency enthusiasts and miners without spammers, scammers or bots. Welcome back. So let me state this very clearly. This is essentially trying to mine Matic at this point, which means that you have set up mining daily payouts from Ethermine to the Matic network. And now you have wrapped Ethereum within your Matic wallet. So the first thing that you will need to do if you haven't followed the guide is make sure that you connect to the custom network, the Matic main net within your MetaMask wallet. Once you have done that, you are going to be able to head on over to your wallet.matic.network and you should see your ETH in here. Now at this point you have a couple options, right? You can withdraw this to the main Ethereum main net or you can keep it in here. What my suggestion is, is if you're doing daily payouts, the primary reason for this is that you are investing into Polygon at this point. So my suggestion would be to convert to Matic or a couple other options on the Matic network, including AAVE that we'll talk about in an upcoming video shortly. But for now, let's just say we want to hold on to some Matic. Well, to do that, we don't have to do anything else as far as connecting anything. We just need to head to quickswap.exchange. Now, when you're on quickswap.exchange, you will need to connect your wallet. The one that you want to connect is going to be the Matic main net. So you will open your MetaMask, click down on the little arrow, and then go down to Matic main net. At this point, it should populate over here. If ETH and Matic are not selected, you can just do the down button and search for ETH, select your ETH, and then select the Matic you want and then swap as much ETH as you want out. So if we swapped 0.16, we could have 263 Matic, and then we would cl click the swap button. Now at this point, you will get the information on how much ETH you are swapping, how much, of course, Matic you're getting. It does look like it got a price update, so we clicked accept, and then the price impact and the liquidity provider fee. Now, because we're on the layer two solution for Polygon, it's gonna be a lot cheaper than if we were trying to do this on something like Uniswap, which is why I said the primary goal of mining to the Ethereum network is to basically have these lower fees when you're swapping into Matic itself. So you can confirm the swap and you can adjust your gas limits, etc. and then you can click confirm. At this point, it will be submitted and you can go ahead and click close and you will have a pending transaction here and it will notify you when it's complete. Alrighty, so now as you can see, we have 263 Matic and zero Ethereum. We can confirm that by going into our MetaMask wallet, making sure the Matic mainnet is selected. And you can see here that we have 263 Matic. 
So that's pretty much how to do a swap from Ethereum to Matic on the Polygon Layer 2 solution. We do have some other options that we're taking a look at to further increase your profits when mining Ethereum. So this is basically step two in a three-part guide. I will try to make a playlist of it. The first one will be, of course, setting up Ethermine to pay out to the Matic network daily. The second step is to swap, of course, to Matic or other options depending on what you want to do in the next step using the AAVE platform. What this will do is essentially allow you to deposit assets, whether that's Ethereum or Matic or DAI or USDT, and earn an interest rate on it on a decentralized platform as opposed to using something like BlockFi. This is much better because you have control of your keys, not your keys, not your wallet. Another great thing about this is that AAVE does support Ledger and we can go into that later. It also supports Trezor and there are a lot of options there. The problem is Polygon is really stuck on MetaMask at this point uh, for your Ethermine payout. So all the guides will be with MetaMask and we'll talk about the rest later on. So. Hope this video was helpful. If it was, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. If you're a little confused, don't worry. We're going to try to walk you through it. But the basic concept is just making more money with the investment you've already done into your mining farm. If you are not taking these opportunities, yes, there's some risk to it. But if you're not taking them, then you are possibly losing out on additional revenue. And you know how I feel about revenue. It's King. I'll see you next Tuesday. If you enjoyed this content, you can watch more by clicking this playlist up here or go ahead and subscribe.